Dear Father, I come to you today, Lord God, just thank you and praise you for everything you've done, everything you're doing right now. I just ask that you touch our hands, touch our minds, Lord God, touch our voices so that we can put this music out to the people and they will accept it and love it. I thank you, Father, for every fellowship and relationship that is going on in this room. I ask you con to continue to bless us and keep us, send your angels to encamp in and around us so any snares of the enemy may, may be trumped. Lord God, I thank you and I praise you. In your name I pray. Amen. Amen. All right. Uh, yeah, bro, let's start with... Uh, it's always been a dream of mine, but there are so many people out there, like, who have dreams, but not a lot of people actually take that step to be like, I'm about to go live a dream right quick. Very few people do it. That's why you only have very few people who actually accomplish, because out of those very few people that say, okay, I'm going to do this, there are another fewer people that say, I'm going to do it, and they do it, and then there are even fewer people that say, I'm going to do it. I'm doing it now, and I'm gonna continue to do it until I get what the fuck I wanna do. We got my dude right here, back up vocalist and lead vocals at times. Mr. Bill Delano, got my boy, Mr. Eric, super producer, first floor studios. Got my boy Jeremy, God saying, love him to death. My boy Paul, the drummer, you'll see him in a little bit. You know what I'm saying? That's my nigga Brian, dog. How old y'all think he is, bro? How old do you think he is? Brian, how old are you, bro? 22. <laughs> that man look good for his age, bro. I'ma say it like that, bro. Niggas, niggas would be happy, bro, to look like this man down when you get old, bro. I know I'm trying to, you feel me, but where it's out. Man, shut up. Don't uh, say it. <laughs> Don't say it, bro. Hey, we in this bitch, man. <laughs> we in this bitch, man. We in this bitch. I thank God for all these people, man. He ain't stopped playing yet, either. He been having, they been having a vibe going the whole time, bro. Yo, we about to fucking rip it. We about to fucking rip it. K Blue pushes. It's about to go down right now. Niggas, it's popping. 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 I just want to thank everybody that came out to the show today. Um, it's about to be a great show. About to put it down. Pushes, K Blue. Uh, how that's what? More previous. It's got a better, it's like it's still more upbeat. It's like upbeat. Oh, shit, get your game made it thump. See, I'm hip hop, like the hippie to the hippie to the hip hop. You know, stop the rock to the bang to the boot of the beat. You move your feet, touch your heart like middle school, touching your first girl heart. Fuck guys, if you a chick, scared shit. Looking at it like, baby, can you handle this? May sound like you're the rich, try to swallow the rich, but there's rappers out there. Take me to this. I think that's what it was. There we go. Okay. Yeah, we just gotta turn your ring so just Yeah, that's cool. cool. Alright, let's do it again. I got high and I forgot the words at the beginning and I was trying to. Yeah, huh? Yeah. And a lot of people from back home, they'll tell you, like I was talking to my homegirl Kelsey, uh, my homeboy Brandon tells me all the time, he like, bruh, I don't know what it is, he was like, I love your DJ shit, I love your DJ sets, but it's something about you with a band, bruh, Kelsey was saying the same thing, she was like, I love your band stuff, like, that, that shit's crazy, and I, I think it's because, um, I think it's because that live sound is like, 
coming back you know what i'm saying like the 19 it's kind of real 1920-ish like a renaissance period i don't think people really re recognize that and like know that i liked everything my boy carrie killed it it was so good i love the band and of course i love everything he does it's amazing i love it now that I came up, now they call me Mr. I'm on fire, bitch. Now they call me Mr. Now that I came up, now they call me Mr. Yeah. Now they call me Mr. Now that I came up, now they call me Mr. I'm on fire, bitch. Now they call me Mr. I think there's about to be a period of passion like this world has never seen. I think there's about to be a period of discovery of life and who we are and what we do. Like this world has never seen. And I'm gonna be one of those people that help ushers it in. I'm gonna be one of those people that literally makes meaning for life for other people. That's what I wanna do. That's what's about to happen. There's about to be a renaissance. Art is about to go crazy. People's minds and knowledge of things is about to go crazy, and I'm gonna help usher that in. You know, nowadays it seems like there's a lot of bad hip hop going on. And we're gonna get back, to, back, to, back to our soul. Yo, what happened to the love and what happened to the passion? Quick flashing with these MP3 spats. Back, back, back to our hey, yo, what happened to the love and what happened to the passion? Quick flashing with these MP3 spats. In the days of Etta James and Billy Holiday, people said what they lived and they lived what they say. They weren't bad bitches, just beautiful ladies. More about the love of life than always being.